你好，三年级的朋友们 ，Hi, my third grade friends. This week, we're gonna start to talk about time zone and how to tell time in Chinese. This matches perfectly with what you guys are doing in math. So hopefully, you will get to become even more familiar with how to tell time and the concept of time zone through this video. 好 ，Enjoy. Why do we have different time zones? Cause we have different watches. Nah, our Earth rotates on its own axis. Due to this rotation, different parts of the Earth receive different amounts of sunlight, thus causing morning, noon, evening, and night. Now, if we had one time zone, then 12 p.m. would be noon at some places, but it would be night or evening at other places, which would be inconvenient. <laughs> Hence, scientists made different time zones according to the Earth's rotation with respect to the sun. But how? The Earth makes one full 360-degree rotation in 24 hours. This means in one hour, the Earth moves by 15 degrees. Using this information, scientists divided the planet into 24 sections or time zones. Each section or region was about 15 degrees wide and had a specific standard time. This helped us know the proper time of the day in that part of the Earth. Hmm. Hold on, guys. Can you guess the title of my next video? Huh? Hurry up! Write your guess in the comment section below. So we learned a little bit about the concept for time zone through the last video. And here in the United States and Mexico, we also have very different different time zones because Mexico is 非常大 is very is a very big country. So you will look at it. There is the Eastern time zone. So we're in Connecticut, so we function with the Eastern time zone. Then there is the Central time zone, the Mountain time zone time zone. In the Pacific time zone, so time is a little bit different for all of us. Even though we all live in the United States, of course, Alaskan and Hawaii, they also have their time different time zone because they are quite farther away from the United States. So, what does it mean that different time zones, you know, have different names? Well, that means when it is. 8 a.m. here in Connecticut in the Eastern Time Zone. It is only 7 a.m. in Texas, and it is only 6 a.m. in Colorado in the Mountain Time Zone, and 5 a.m. in California and Washington and Oregon. Oh, so when you wake up at 8 a.m. in the morning here in the Eastern Time Zone, if you have relatives in the Pacific Time Zone in California, don't call them because it's still 5 a.m. in their hour during their time. How? So, friends, before we talk more about time zone, obviously we're going to dive into the time zone in Songguo in China in a little bit. Um, but let's learn how to do actually time and tell and say time in Chinese. First, let's review. 复习一下复习 Okay, 所以我们有一二 Hope you're reading with me. 三四五六七八九十、十一和十二。Obviously, with time and clock, you only need to know how to count to 十二 in Chinese. 太简单了 ，easy stuff. Then we have the word 点点
Dan is for the shorthand on your clock, meaning the hour. So Dan comes after all the hours when you say it, and then you have the other word, fen. Let me hear you say it, fen. Fen is your minutes, obviously, and so it's the second part of your time, right? So you have Dan, he fen. Dian he fen. So how you would say one o five? You would be you would say. Close one is e. Dian u fen. Got that one? You say it. So that's practice. This one will be. Oh, you would normally say "er," right? E er. But in Chinese, when you're actually counting something, "er" becomes something different. That's the only number you won't say "er." You say "liang," okay? "Liang," so "liang," "dian," "wu," "fen." Now you do it yourself. "Liang dian wu fen." 非常好。那最后一个会怎么说呢？嗯。If you said 三点五分，你就是对了，对了。所以不要忘了加点 after the hour， 分 after the minute。Okay， 好。Friends, this is Mr. Ragland. 你好，这是张老师。Today, me and Mrs. Cheng are going to work with you and help you to work on telling time. We're going to tell time both in English and Chinese, and we're going to need you to follow along with us and make sure that you're practicing along with what we're saying too. So when me and Mrs. Cheng are talk or say something, we want you to repeat after us, okay? So let's get started, friends. Okay, 好，然后 share screen. Share. Okay. Turn on my. All right, friends. So, what we're going to do is, I am going to read the time to you in English first, and I would like you to repeat after me. After you repeat what I said, Mrs. Chang is going to tell you the time in Chinese, and then please repeat after her. And we're going to go through all these together. So let's get started, friends. Watch where. Mrs. Cheng and I are underlining on the numbers so you know where we are. Okay, so let's start at the top. One o'clock. 一点 Two o'clock. 两点 Three o'clock. 三点 Four o'clock. 四点 Five o'clock. 五点 Six o'clock. 六点 Seven o'clock. 七点 I hope you're repeating. Eight o'clock. 八点 Nine o'clock. 九点 Ten o'clock. 十点 Eleven o'clock. 十一点 Twelve o'clock. 十二点 
Great job, friends. I know you repeated everything that I said and Miss Chang said. That was excellent. Well done. But that was really easy, right? So we're going to take it up a notch. We're going to try a more challenging, um, a more challenging telling time now. 同学们非常好，太简单了 ，too easy. Okay. Oh. Oh, here we go, friends. We're going to work on this together as well. Please repeat after me when you hear me speak in English, and please repeat after Miss Chang after she says the time in Chinese. Ready, friends? We're gonna start in the top left-hand corner. Follow along or underlining to stay with us. One o five. 一点零五分 Two ten. 两点十分 Three fifteen. Three fifteen. Four twenty. Four twenty. Four twenty. Four twenty. Four twenty. Four twenty. Six thirty. 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 Let's continue at the top in the right-hand corner. Seven thirty-five. Seven thirty-five. Seven thirty-five. Eight forty. 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 四十五分。Ten fifty. 十点五十分。Eleven fifty-five. 十一点五十五分。Here we go. 十二点三十分 or 十二点半。好。Excellent. Great job, friends. I'm so happy that you did so well on that one. We're gonna try something even harder now. We're gonna move on to the next type of clock. Get ready, friends. Here we go. That's right, friends. So this has been a digital clock, which is something that we see a lot on our phone most of the time. But we also have to know how to read an analog clock. Oh, I have to clear all the drawings. So, friends. This is an analog clock. You've seen this as the work when the work you've been doing this week in telling time. Unlike a digital clock, you have to actually read the marks on the face. So we're going to go over how to tell the time looking at an analog clock, both in English and in Chinese. Just like in the last example, please repeat after myself when I say it in English, and repeat after Mrs. Chang when she says it in Chinese. Pay close attention to where. The clock hands are facing while we are saying the time. Okay, friends, let's get started. So this one. Twelve o'clock. I'm、oh, sorry. It's okay. <laughs> sure, Dan. One o'clock. 一点 Oh, so hard to control. Ah.、Uh. <laughs> Come on, okay. <laughs> Two o'clock. 两点 Three o'clock.
o'clock. Oh, did you want to well, say three o'clock? Yeah, sorry, it's <laughs> the end. But the kids, I'm sure they already said it. <laughs> right, right, right. Uh, four o'clock. Sidian. Five o'clock. Wu Dian. Six o'clock. Liu Dian. Seven o'clock. Qi Dian. Eight o'clock. Ba Dian. Nine o'clock. Zhou Dian. Ten o'clock. Shi Dian. Eleven o'clock. Shi Yi Dian. And the last one going back all the way around. All the way around, friends. Great job. Excellent. Remember, when you're looking at the clock, even if you're telling time in English or Chinese, the little hand tells you the hour and the big hand tells you the minute. We're going to practice some more telling time on the next. Uh, uh, we, nah. <laughs> we're going to practice more telling time, and this time we're going to talk about going down to the minute. So be prepared and get ready. Remember, repeat after Mr. Raglan in English and repeat after Mrs. Chang in Chinese, please. Let's Here we go, friends. One first. So let's start with one o'clock, right? And the minute is going to be, um, so you go in increments of five. So this is going to be on five. And if you do not um, see it, you can verify it with this it's not like a digital clock, right? So it matches what we're doing, friends. Okay. 105. Oh, 1 or 1 Ling 5. Uh, okay. 110. 115. 115. One twenty. One twenty-five. One thirty. Oh, one thirty. Is that one that you can do it two ways, right? One thirty-three or one thirty. If you said ban, you're right. One thirty. One thirty-one. One forty. One forty-five. One forty-five. 150. 155. 2 o'clock. 两点,两点. Great job, everybody. Great job. Okay, so, 同学们, okay. so we're going to give you a challenge here. Can you come up with the English and Chinese for the time that's posted on your screen? We're going to give you 10 seconds. If you said three o'clock in English. And if you said San Dian in Chinese. Great job, you did it. <laughs> 对了, 对了, 非常好. Okay, one more.
If you said 1.30 in English, and if you said 1.30 or 1.30, Duela. Great job, everybody. Excellent. You can give yourself a round of applause. You did a great job with this assignment. Friends, oh, uh, did you want to say the end or? Oh, it's okay. Um, okay so, <laughs> so friends, the great friends, 三年级的朋友 this week, um, in your CSL template, you're going to tell us time in English and in Chinese. So I hope you learned um, from this lesson, and thank you, Mr. Riglin, for joining our lesson. This is fun. <laughs> thank you for having me, Miss Chang. It was a lot of fun. I'm, I've got to learn Chinese too, so I'm really excited. I'm going to go practice too. <laughs> 好，非常好，再见。Bye, friends.